Hey guys, Thomas Friends 47 here, and as you may have guessed, we're going to be taking a look at a My First Thomas item. Alright, and that item to be exact is the My First Thomas projector shed, something like that of that nature. It's a basically it's a light up projector. And this is Fisher Price is jump starting the My First Thomas range. The previous My First Thomas range has very, very, very cheap looking toys. They don't look very well made at all. Um, and they, you know, that's not something that I personally want to collect as a Thomas Friends collector. This range, however, has more cute engines like this Thomas, which we're going to take a look at right now. So Thomas here has the most adorable little face ever. It's just super cute. It makes him look kind of like, almost kid-like, which is important. You know, this is going to be for, you know, a age range for a lot lower than the actual show so that they can have Thomas toys too and you know but either way it still has a lot of detail like these buffers the coupling chains there has a molded whistle has all of the boiler bands good detail on the side I don't like the wheels they kind of look like tires to me you got the back there it's just a really really cute engine and the cool thing is when you back him up inside to his shed Right, and so you can hear him there, there's a little bit of a song. The really cool thing, however, is it starts projecting light from the top. You'll notice that on the top of the shed, it has all these little shapes, and that's because it's actually going to project that. So, let's take a look at that projector. So you'll kind of see there on the background. And we're going to listen to this song because it's just so beautiful. cool is this thing, right? Well, I'm going to tell you about a few more features and then we'll go ahead and call this video an end, get a final rating on it. Okay, so the day projector mode is on for up to two minutes and then it automatically shuts off. And then the night mode, which is the mode that we're currently on, we've switched to, is on for 10 minutes. It plays lullaby and other phrases and then the lights, you know, slowly go out and then, in, or well, I guess it goes out anyway after 10 minutes and it shuts off. The cool thing with that is this can be used not only as a toy but kind of as a soother for young children that are kind of maybe afraid of the dark. And this just projects stars on their wall and it's, it would be really beautiful and very relaxing too, like as a Thomas fan, even though I'm like 20, I could put this in my room and easily fall asleep by it. You know, if it just had the railway sounds and station sounds, hey, I would totally buy that. Um, anyway, so with this projector, it has a lot of good play points, um, especially for younger kids, which is where this is targeted to. The rails, there's nothing really to line up. It's just like a flat track, and you kind of just park Thomas in the shed. There's grooves in there, so it'll kind of sit where he's meant to. And it has a very baby-friendly, child-friendly look to it. And so we're just going to park Thomas here. So finally, final thoughts. Uh-oh. It's going to start singing again. Okay. Um, with the final thoughts on this, when I saw that it was coming out, I knew I was going to get this. Even if I had ordered through FisherPrice.com, I was getting this. Because it was a very cool, it was a very abstract item. And I actually do plan on collecting the newer range of My First Thomas, the more cutesy, like this range here, uh, range of My First Thomas. The shed itself was $19.99 which I wasn't expecting, you know, seeing it in person that's bigger than what I thought it would be. So it's not necessarily a bad price, but it seems like a lot.
even though it's not really, it's actually a pretty good value, it kind of seems like a lot. You're kind of siding with yourself, mm, should I get this or should I not? But I'm going to be honest with you, I really like it. As a Thomas fan, just displaying it in my room, um, having this, you know, light up on your walls, plus you get the adorable little Thomas with it. For an adult collector, it's a really nice abstract item. For parents who are buying this for younger children, I think it's a great buy. Because, like I said, it doubles as a toy plus a nightlight, and it automatically shuts off after 10 minutes. You don't have to worry about going back in there, you know, an hour risk waking them up and switching it off. It's going to automatically do that so you don't have to go back into the child's room and deal with trying to get it off to, you know, save battery and stuff. And the quality, again, is uh, really well made. It doesn't feel like it's going to fall apart in your hands. It's not cheap at all. You know, the plastic's really good quality. It doesn't move at all when I press on it. And I like that. I wish there was more toys like this. And it's sad that this is becoming a rare occurrence these days with Mattel. I don't know what you guys are doing up there, but I want you to release more stuff like this. That would be amazing. Focus on more detailed, more strongly built stuff, more durable, because that really does go a long way. Anyway, these are my thoughts on this product. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Tell me what you think about this product in the uh, comment section below. And, you know, if you like that the product, you might want to check out your local Toys R Us. That's where I found this. You could probably also find it on FisherPrice.com. Um, and for Thomas fans, a word of advice. You can go to FisherPrice.com. You have to be 18 years or older. And you can go to uh, Fisher Price Shop. And you can actually order a free Fisher Price catalog. And by ordering a Fisher Price catalog, you can, um, you know, they have Thomas and Friends items in there as well as some other Mattel brands. So you might want to check that out. But anyway, this is Thomas and Friends 47 signing off. Sweet dreams.